My name is Clarence Code Gomberg. Uh, my rank was T5, Corporal T5 Technician. Uh, we was attached to the 343rd Medical Battalion, 3rd Army, uh, World War II, U.S. Army. April 1945, we had a run through uh, Liège, Belgium, Brussels, Antwerp, and up in the northwest corner of Germany, we came, started down along the border, a town called Weimar, Germany. Okay. Weimar, Germany, we pulled into a siding, and uh, along the siding, there was a barbed wire, barbed, barbed wire fence and an MP standing there. And I hadn't asked, the, got off the train, and I asked the MP, I said, what is this? And he says, a concentration camp. And uh, I said, can I go in? He said, yes. And I walked in, and I seen these big, looked like big pizza ovens. To me, they resembled a pizza oven. I said, where are they? He says, that's where they were cremating the bodies. And it was empty. And I says, oh, can I walk through? I says, yes. I walked through, and I got into another section. It was dark. And somewhere along the way, there, there was a a terrible odor coming up out of that that section. I don't know if it was a pit or what it was. I ran out. I got outside and I was throwing up. After I talked to the MP, okay, and he told me it was a concentration camp. And he said, Bogenwald concentration camp. Well, he could have told me it was Ford's Field. It didn't make any difference to me because I didn't know what a concentration camp was. I didn't know what, what Bogenwald was either. The guard says, you know, this is a prison camp for the Jewish, you know, the Jewish population, okay? Well, I couldn't imagine, you know, a camp, you know, just rounded up off the streets, all the people, you know, and put them in a the camp like prisoners. For what reason? For what reason, you know? Things, memories, uh, you never forget. I mean, maybe a lot of other fellows or people, you know, just to pass of mind and forget about it. But something like that, you, you don't forget. It's something you'll never see again in your lifetime. In my lifetime, anyhow, you know. But... You couldn't imagine, you know, something like that was going on. But when you see it cold blank, like that, you know, then it hits you, you know. And you remember, it. it's there, it's there. It'll be there until the day they put me in the ground.